What's going on guys, my name is James Kalex and as promised we're going to be unboxing the Yu-Gi-Oh! Monster Shootout. Now I picked this up literally a couple of days ago from a car boot sale. I paid a whopping £2. This goes online for anywhere between £50 and £70 as long as all the parts are working. Now unfortunately there are a few issues with this one so uh when I do list it, obviously I'll have to state everything that's wrong with it, but for the time being, we are going to unbox it. So, the box itself is fairly straightforward. So, there's the instructions on the back as to how to play the game. All you have to do is load, shoot, take down your opponent's monsters, and strike your opponent's duelist platform. It's a lot easier said than done, believe me. I've tried, and it took me a good dozen attempts to actually knock one off so it comes with not everything you can see here it actually comes with the great moth and the summon skull it doesn't come with anything else although you can get the others all in boosters but we do have a few more so i've already unboxed it so let's have a look at it and here it is so this is what it's supposed to look like once it's all together now, I bought this where the, the main base itself stays in one piece now. All that comes out is these yellow pieces and these side panels here. Everything else stays as one. These come out also, they're quite large bulky bits though. And the reason why I left one out is so that I can show you guys how this works. Although this is the one that is faulty. So what is supposed to happen is this here is supposed to pull back, which pulls back on a spring. So that when you load into this hole here, it then fires out this little ball, which are very, very easy to lose. Turns out it works just fine if it's actually attached. There must be some sort of a, of a link between that bolt head and the bits inside. So if you do pull it off and it doesn't seem to work when it's not a part of the game, that would be your reason why. So as long as it is attached, it works fine. If you detach it, it does not work. Learn from my mistakes. So that goes into there. You pull that back, you fire, and the idea is to aim for your opponent's monster. So if we set up the moth, let's just push that into the right place push that into the right place as well so you would put the monsters in place put one monster on each part take it in turns to load up and this is going to be the part where it takes me several years to actually hit it right let's try it second go did you see that i'm actually really impressed with myself so there we go that monster's now out and then what you would do is eventually you would keep on going take all the monsters out and then you go after the duelist himself now to do that when you set up the game you pull this up and you put your duelist on top of here and obviously when you do that this bumper starts to protrude so if we hit that that drops down so when you do that in the game that's how you lose so you push it up, that comes out. So once that gets hit during the game, that's it, it is game over. Now, in theory, I presume you are supposed to take out all of your opponent's monsters first, rather than just go directly for the duelist himself. But yeah, that is the boxed version. However, as I said, I managed to get some extras. And these are the said extras. Now, I need to show you guys very, very briefly a few of the bits that was inside this bag. This is my own personal freezer bag. Sainsbury's finest freezer bags. So there's, there's quite a few bits in here, as you can see. There's only a few that are complete. Let's get them all out of the bag first. Right, so all the ones that have the black panels are all there. So we do have a Blue Eyes White Dragon. We do have a Mega Zowler. We do have a Time Wizard. We do have a Baby Dragon. That's not Baby Dragon. We do have a Vorse Raider. 
there's the time wizard there we go so he would go and sit over there we also have a blue eyes toon dragon which is that guy just there we do have the flute of summoning dragon dark magician girl thousand dragon there we go that's the bad boy that we want now see with a thousand dragon i remember the thousand dragon was the first ever first edition yugo card that i ever had there you go random stupid fact we have magic hats which we saw them earlier which is those three guys just there the figures themselves are actually quite cool from a collector's standpoint i'd imagine they are quite collectible dark magician one of Yu-Gi-Oh's right-hand men. We also have Lord of D, which stands for dragons. Right, now this guy is there. Then we have a random red eyes black dragon, which again looks really, really awesome. This is a berserker, I think. Is that berserker? This is going back on my memory now. This guy is there and um, we don't have a card for him dark magician girl we've got one of those although the pose does seem to be different it looks like it is actually supposed to be that version um that looks like a strange blue eyes white dragon we do have a dark magician there's the flute lord of dragons i have no idea who that is A tiny dark magician. I think some of these are knockoff toys, but I'm just going to put them all together. Baby dragon, which is absolutely adorable. I've forgotten his name. Phoenix Pharaoh. No. Oh, that's going to really, really bug me. I know that's Joey. Oh, damn it. He's the one who had relinquished in his bloody deck. Um, this is the forbidden one what's his name oh my god i've forgotten everyone's names you you go really wasn't my my thing i i dabbled in it when i was younger we've also got a load of tazos as well from the old walkers packs do you remember back in the day when you used to get tazos out of packets of crisps and they put did they put 20 pound notes in them at one stage as well red eyes black dragon that is absolutely awesome i i really do like it i've got a couple of friends who are into their Yu-Gi-Oh stuff obviously the older stuff is preferred so i'm going to speak to them first see if they want first dibs um failing that this is unfortunately all going to be going on ebay i think i will be uh aiming high and then putting best offer on but yeah i'm uh i'm really happy with that two pound well spent and it's actually a very, very, very easy game to play. It's time to do, 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 do. You've got tons of monsters to choose from. Now you've got the place to duel them. New from the world of Yu-Gi-Oh! comes Monster Shootout. Put your skills to the test in an all-out battle to become champion dueler. Take that, Swordstalker! Yeah! You haven't seen the last of me. Yeah, I'm ready. When your opponent has no more moves, it's time to take him out. Yeah! This duel's finished! Are you ready to duel? Monster Shootout Playset comes with two figures. Adult assembly required, other figures each sold separately.